don't think your targets are going anywhere. Okay, a little more shooting and a little less preening, huh? Wow, nice shooting tits. All right, I'm bad. I'm a badass. I'm gonna go ahead and guess it was a wild case of beginner's luck. Nah, no, I don't think so, girl. Well, anybody and their brother could shoot a bottle that big, that close. I'm just getting the hang of this. Come on, Chris, the cable car. After a whole year. Yeah. Hey, that's weird. Door's locked. Yeah. Uh, Josh wanted us to keep it locked to keep people out. He said that? What people? I, I don't know. He said they found people sleeping in the station one time. It's creepy. After you. Oh, real gentleman. of killing time at the shooting range. How long is this going to take? It's a big mountain. Yeah. It's so beautiful in the day, but at night just feels menacing, like sleeping giant. You going to publish? What? Your pretty poem. The Sleeping Giant of Blackwood Forest. Oh, shut up. Stay here and catch some Z's, but okay. Mm, just like going to the prom. Here we go. Right. Adventure begins. Oh, yeah, this was the right thing to do. What? You know, getting everyone together on the anniversary. I mean, Josh seemed really pumped about us all doing something, didn't he? Yeah, no, he definitely did. I haven't seen him so excited about something in forever. Good, good. It's hard to tell with him, and I, and I've kind of been worried. No, no, it was, it was a good idea. I hope everyone else feels the same way. We're all here, aren't we? Thanks, bro, good talk. You know what? Let's just let's just stop talking about what happened and enjoy the trip. 
Uh, you know what, you're right. You know how Josh and I met? No. Third grade. Josh sat in the back of the room, I sat in the front. We didn't even know each other existed. But the kid sitting next to Josh started strap snapping the training bra on the girl in front of him. So the teacher made him move to the front, where I was sitting. Okay, so? So I got moved to the back. And? And next to Josh. That's how we met. I mean, and became friends to this day. A match made in heaven. If it weren't for the fact that Jeannie Simmons hit puberty like three years early, and on that day decided to wear a low-cut shirt that showed off her training bra, I mean, who knows? You could be riding in this cable car alone. Right now. Or we're talking to some other person entirely. Boom. Butterfly effect. Over here! Uh, are you guys having a really weird stroke? We're stuck in this stupid thing. Can you please let us out? Pretty please? Oh my god. I thought we were goners. Another ten minutes in there and I would have chewed off my own leg. Oh, sick, Chris. Look, I got a lot of meat on my bones. It's all muscle down here. Yeah, right. Uh-huh. Hey, Chris. <laughs> I'm just doing like Sam taught me. Other people's private thoughts are my own personal playground. Do not be a jerk. My goodness. Seems that someone has a little crush on our good friend and dear class president, Michael Monroe. Chris. And what kind of sizzling erotica might our Jessica be capable of imagining? I wonder. Mike and M split. We're together. Whoa. Drama. Not really. Pretty clear cut, actually. M's out, I'm in. Oh. All right, all right. Let's just get up to the lodge already. It's getting tired of all this nature and junk. Uh, you guys go ahead. I'm just gonna wait here for a bit. See who else is coming. You mean Mike? What? I mean, you know, whoever. Uh-huh. Sam? <sighs> Did you see this view? I mean, holy cow. Sometimes I forget to just stop and take it all in. 